Uh, Ed Barnard, what a fight back. Yeah, I think it was a strange session really. I think um, obviously they started really well and we lost lost a couple early, which can happen I think. Um, maybe a few early season nerves in there and obviously with the rain delay it does, doesn't make it easy to start. But yeah, I think the way Dolly came out and batted there, like especially his first game as skipper to show that determination and the leadership. Um, it was nice just to get out there and put a few runs and put the pressure back on them a little bit. Yeah, you're going to run a ball in that partnership. So, I mean, it really was, um, you know, you'd be thinking, oh, end of the day, if they're still four down, don't matter how many runs are on the board, but you got the runs as well. Yeah, I think that just sort of, I think Don and I both quite naturally play quite quick tempo cricket. Um, I think the pitch as well allows for that and the outfield here, it's a very quick outfield and it's a good cricket wicket. I think if you bowl in the right areas, there seems to be enough in it to take wickets, but if you did miss, it seemed to be nice and came on to bat. So. I think they've both contributed to the scoring rate. Uh, you can imagine on a day like today, delayed start, bit of in the pitch, wind blowing across. Chris Wright was going to bowl well, wasn't he? Yeah, he, look, he's an experienced pro. He's been playing for years. He's, some lads have been talking about. I think he's earned over 500 first class wickets. So you know what you're going to get from him, and it's no surprise when he does bowl well. Um, but I thought the other lads actually played him quite well early on, and I thought they negated him to start with. Obviously, he got a couple, couple as he went on, but yeah, he's he's a good bowler. He's allowed to bowl well, and like you say, in the early season conditions, he's going to be very effective. Yeah, um, Hendricks looked a bit quick coming down the slope. Did you, you didn't face him that much, did you? No, I managed to get the back end of his spell, but um, yeah, he's a big lad actually. He's a, he's a bit taller than I thought. Um, but yeah, the lad said he bowled with some good pace and some good skills, but you'd expect that from a South African Test bowler. So. Um, We'll be there in the morning to fight back against him, hopefully. But yeah, he's a, obviously a high-skilled bowler. Yeah, but a gym in the pitch could be hard work in the morning. Yeah, I think so. I think every time you're in overnight, you've got to start again from the morning. It's a fresh start. Uh, me and Dole look to do exactly what we've done tonight, get ourselves in, and hopefully we can start to build a score that we can turn into a match winner one. Super, thanks, mate. Cheers, brothers. Uh, Dolly looks, reminds us a bit of Joe Root, he's so busy at the crease isn't he? Yeah he's great to bat with, I've always said it, him and Coxie as well, they're very similar the way they're, they're constantly looking for those singles and twos and turning turning runs that aren't there into runs really and um, I think in that situation it's perfect because it really puts the pressure back on the bowlers. Because he would have felt um, a real sense of pride today wouldn't he, his first official game as captain, he would have been keen to make an impression and he certainly did. Yeah a huge moment for him I think. And, uh, I think the amount of time now he's been building towards this day for a while, I think he'll just be happy to have got through today now and sort of he can just crack on with the job. Like you say, it's a very proud moment for him and his family again. Um, and we're all super delighted for him to be our leader and we're all behind him. What do you think might be a good score on that wicket then, uh, Ed? Uh, I think it's quite tough to say at the minute. Um, obviously, any time you can sort of get up towards 300 in the first innings would be nice, but look, we're four wickets down, we're still not in a, in a, in a great position. Obviously, we're in a lot less position than we were. Um, but like I said to brothers, it will just be about coming in the morning and restarting and see where we get to at lunch and then hopefully kick on from there. And yourself, you started off, how you finished last year? I mean, it would be nice to start uh, like you did that first game again. Yeah, that would be nice. Um, yeah, I feel good at the minute with my batting. I've, I've been practising hard all winter on it again after last season. And like I said, I've said before, I want to kick on with it again. I want to score more and more runs. So it's pleasing to have got a few tonight and come back in the morning with a few to my name. But hopefully there's a few more out there.